I want to read 1 Peter chapter 5, verse 8 to you. Listen to what the Bible says. Be sober. Be vigilant. Because your adversary, the devil, as a roaring lion, walketh about, seeking those whom he may devour. But listen to what the word of God says in verse 9. But whom resist him steadfast in the faith. You got to be steadfast in your faith. And resist the devil. Knowing that the same afflictions are accomplished in your brethren that are in the world. James chapter 4 verse 7 says. Submit yourselves. Therefore to God. Resist the devil. And he will flee from you. Submit yourselves, therefore, to God. Resist the devil, and he will flee from you. That word resist means to get on the offense, to fight back. Don't take it laying down this morning. I feel like the Holy Ghost has sent me to just encourage somebody <coughs> who felt like giving up who felt like throwing the towel in who felt like it's not even worth it's not even worth it to keep on believing God because I've been believing God so long that I hadn't seen any results that I don't even know if I can hang in there for another day but the Holy Ghost wants you to hang in there you are under a severe attack of the enemy I want you to hear me the Bible says we wrestle not against flesh and blood but against principalities against powers against the rulers of the darkness of this world. Therefore, take unto you the whole armor of God that you may be able to stand in the evil day. You know the Bible says we take up the shield of faith wherewith we shall be able to quench all the fiery darts of the enemy. Oh, I feel the Holy Ghost want me to pray for you this morning. Come on, saints. Come on there, brother. Come on there, sister. Come on, join your faith with me. I want you to rise up in your faith and take a stand against the devil of your soul. Satan, we rebuke you in the name of Jesus. Come on, join your faith. Come on, take a stand against the enemy. I'm here to help coach you this morning in the Holy Ghost. I'm here to coach you in spiritual warfare. Come on and open your mouth and rebuke the devil. Open your mouth and take authority. For the Bible says in Matthew chapter 18, verse 18, whatever we bind on earth, will be bound in heaven. Satan, we bind you in the name of Jesus. Every principality, every power, every ruler of the darkness of this world, every spiritual wickedness in high places, we rebuke you in the name of Jesus. We rebuke a spirit of poverty. We rebuke a spirit of infirmity. We rebuke you in the name of Jesus. We rebuke a devil of cancer. We rebuke it in the name of Jesus. Your children, it seems like they've just lost their mind. I rebuke the devil from off your children. I command the devil to turn your son loose, to turn your daughter loose in the name of Jesus Christ. Satan, you have no authority. <coughs> you have no power. You have no authority to hold their, their children in bondage. I command you to loose them in the name of Jesus. Come out of that young man. Come out of that young daughter. Loose her. Let her go free in the name of Jesus. I come to you as a servant of the Most High God. I come to you in the name of Jesus this morning and I command you to loose that marriage. Turn that marriage loose in the name of Jesus. You will not divorce. You will not divorce. You will not give up on your husband. Oh, I feel the Holy Ghost is talking to some women this morning. You want to throw the towel in on your marriage? Don't give up. You're on the brink of a miracle. You're on the brink of a supernatural turnaround. God's about to save your husband. I feel this this morning. God's about to save him. God's about to deliver him. God's about to set him free. That's what the fight is about. That's why this battle have intensified against you. Ah, but I say to you, like the prophet said to Jehoshaphat in 2 Chronicles chapter 
20, he said, you shall not need fight in this battle because the battle is not yours. The battle belongs to the Lord. I know the enemy has come against you, roaring against you. Ah, but I shut the mouth of the enemy. We trample him under our feet right now. For Jesus said, I've given you power to tread on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy and absolutely nothing should by any means hurt you. I speak strength into your spirit this morning. I speak strength into your spirit this morning. I speak courage into your spirit this morning. I speak courage into your spirit, man. I speak courage. I speak strength. I speak faith. I speak peace. I say peace. Be still in the midst of your storm. Peace. Be still in the name of Jesus. This too shall pass. You coming out of this more than a conqueror. You coming out of it. I say you coming out of it. You coming out of it in the name of Jesus. You coming out. You coming out. You coming out of it. I said you coming out of this thing in the name of Jesus. For it's not by power, it's not by might, but it's by my spirit, says the Lord. When the enemy comes against you like a flood, the spirit of God will raise up a standard against him. Come on, lift your hands to heaven. The Holy Ghost is raising a standard against the enemy. He's raising a standard against the enemy. Let it rain, Jesus. Open the floodgates of heaven. Let it rain. Let it rain. Open the floodgates of heaven. Let it rain. Let it rain. Open, open the floodgates of heaven. Let it rain. Let it rain. Jesus, open the floodgates. Oh Lord, we worship you, Jesus. We worship you, oh God. Lord, receive our worship this morning, oh God. Receive our worship, oh God. Receive our worship, oh God. Receive our worship, Jesus. Receive our worship, oh God. Oh Lord. Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight. Oh Lord, my strength and my redeemer, we love you this morning. Oh, we love you, Jesus. We love you. We love you, Jesus. We love you, Jesus. We love you, Lord. We love you, Lord. Be blessed this day. The victory is yours. God is on your side. God bless you. I look forward to being with you on another precious morning, worshiping Jesus, bringing in our day in the presence of God. We love you. God bless you.